A final of the men's 400 IM. That's Billy Swarthwout from Long Island in lane one. Will Hine has lane two for the Bluefish Swim Club. Adam Capusta from Long Island in three. And there's Jason Lauser, the top seed at 433-36. Won 100 breast earlier tonight. That's Harry Homans in lane six for Bluefish. He's won three events as meet. Emils Jurgic in lane six for Delaware. Michael Gregorace from lane, in lane seven for Long Island. And that's Timothy Marski in lane eight, also from LIAC. So we mentioned Jason Lauser, your top seed. He had an outstanding swim this morning to earn that top seed. He's won both breaststroke events at this meet, including the 100 tonight. Harry Homans was second in the 100 fly after winning the two fly, the two IM, and the 100 backstroke last night. He should win the, 100 back, the 200 back coming up later on tonight as well. So it's a, a busy night of racing for these fellows. After, right after that, of course, Harry's going to get on a bus with his Bluefish teammates and drive back four hours to New England. Out in lane eight, Timothy Marski is your early leader. Marski, Capusta in lane three, Adam Capusta, and then Homans. Lauser just has to keep it close because he's way better than any of these swimmers on the breaststroke. The Bluefish coach Chuck Batchelor said Harry's going to try and win it on the freestyle leg. But unless he's way ahead after the backstroke, he won't be close when it goes to the freestyle because Lauser's that good at breaststroke. That's Capusta leading at 101.39. Marski second, Homans third. Homans at 136.34. So he's almost four seconds ahead of Jason Lauser. Jason Lauser is going to make up that ground and more on the breaststroke. Tonight he was a 105.8 in the 100 breaststroke. So that gap looks big. But in a long course on a breaststroke, it can be overcome and quick. Holmans turns in 210-12. Capusta in 212-19. And there's Lauser, almost eight seconds back. Well, here he comes. Imagine the feeling of be swimming a race knowing, well, a lot of you, a lot of the swimmers out there, if anyone's watching, won't have to imagine of swimming a race knowing that you're being tracked down stroke by stroke. You don't know how far ahead, but you know he's coming. And he's coming. It might not look like much, but he's made, oh, what just happened there? Homans froze on the wall. Out split by two seconds on that first 50 of breaststroke. Maybe that lead he built was enough. Lauser has made, it was two seconds behind Capusta that turn. He's made that up already. And moved into second, Capusta is third. Emil Zirkic is fourth. But if Holman still has a lead going into the freestyle, he should be able to hold on and make up for that loss earlier tonight in the 100 fly. He does still have the lead, 330.71. And Lauser outsplit him again by almost three seconds, but it's not gonna matter, I don't think, here as he is second, followed by Capusta. And then your kitchen hind. Harry Omens looking for his fifth win of, fourth win of the weekend. Got a great kick behind him. Great versatile swimmer. And he'll win this one easily. 
He was a 437.96 this morning. Going to be much, much quicker than that here tonight. Four thirty three point four one. Lauser was second, four thirty seven oh one, and Capusta third, four thirty two, four thirty nine two oh. Lauser's time this morning actually faster than Homan's went just there, so it would have been cool to see them race at full strength, but it's the end of the meet, long meet. Nice swim there for Homan's.